So you might be in a position where your Oculus Quest 2 just keeps telling you that the mobile core services have stopped or the core mobile services have stopped. It's a very, very strange issue. Now, the reason why this may be happening for the most part is because you're running some, you know, you're just running into a random bug that sometimes happens. So what you're going to want to do, the very first thing I'd recommend doing is restarting your headset. So you can either, you know, click the buttons to actually restart it, or you can hold down the button on the side of your specific headset to actually restart and reboot that headset. A lot of the times that's probably all you're going to have to do. And that is exactly what I would recommend doing in this specific situation. Rebooting and restarting your headset is the easiest thing you can do here. And that's basically what I'd recommend doing in this case. Now, if that's not working or for some reason that doesn't seem to be working at all, the next thing you, wanted, you may want to do is update specific applications. So if you make your way over to the Oculus Quest store, what you can do is you can basically go into, actually, you probably don't want to do that. You want to go into settings. You then want to go and click into applications. You then want to, under the updates tab in the library, you want to see if there's any updates available for any of those applications. Now, some of the tutorials I've seen, they do recommend doing the voice commands app, you know, updating that one. But if for some reason that's not available or if that doesn't seem to be the issue, you can try seeing if you can update all those applications because a lot of the time, that's probably all you're going to have to do. And that's probably what I'd recommend doing in that specific situation. Now, another thing is if you want to go ahead and update your headset in general, so the complete headset, this is another thing that probably going to you know, help you out too. So go ahead and just update that headset. And that's probably another thing you can do. If that's still not working, you may want to go ahead and just reset your headset. This is like the last step and I probably wouldn't recommend doing this, but if nothing else is working, that's probably the final thing I'd recommend doing here. So in terms of that, that kind of covers it up there. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, soul then.